Hello, I'm going to be guiding you through uh, the process of tying a Windsor knot. Sometimes it's called a double Windsor knot, um, but it's basically that symmetrical looking uh, knot that you may have seen. It sits up real snug and nice uh, underneath the collar there, looks really even and clean. Um, the one thing to remember about tying a Windsor knot though is that uh, it does take up a lot more tie to actually complete. So if you're left with a little tiny bit of tie when you normally tie your ties, a Windsor knot is definitely not something that you want to try or else you'll be left with practically nothing. But um, it definitely works for any mid-length ties or even, you know, definitely longer ties. So um, yeah, give it a shot. And it is the, uh, the knot I hear that Bond prefers, so there you have it. But anyway, so let's get started. What you want to do is you want to take the fat end and you want to take it and bring it over the smaller end right there. Then you're going to bring that fat end underneath and up. And after you bring that underneath and up, you're going to want to pull that over. Kind of pulls it a little bit tight right there, you see? Then you're going to bring the fat end underneath and behind just like that. I'm going to kind of do a similar step where you just take it again and you put it right back down through the hole. You see it'll start to form a pretty symmetrical looking triangle there. Make sure that you can see that. See it looks nice and symmetrical on the sides. So after you have that looking, there's going to be coming down like this. You just have one final step. You come and you wrap it around the front like that. And then you go underneath and you guessed it. Down and through. Now, here's a problem. That's a pretty honking knot, right? Well, the trick to making most tie knots look good is by the way that you tighten them. So what you're going to want to do is three things. You're going to pull on this fat end, this fat piece. You're going to pinch at the same time, and you're going to pull. So you're going to pull this down, pinch right here, and be pulling the fat end down as you pinch. So let's try it make sure to see if I can get it a nice shot of it. So you're going to be pinching, pulling, pulling down like that. See it's getting tighter and tighter and as you're pulling you're constantly kind of pushing this thing out. Now when you kind of flatten it down like that you're left with a nice triangle. Then you want to kind of pull the edges of this thing down and around like that get you a nice looking symmetrical Windsor knot. Go ahead and cinch that right up. And you're done. Pretty slick.